As you know, Secretary Granholm, national lab staff are collectively unique, combining remarkable expertise across science and operations to achieve the labs and the department's missions, basically using science and technology to help make the world a better place. I know uh, we've got a lot jammed in, and so let's dive. We're located on Long Island, about 60 miles from the city, from Manhattan, about 2,500 staff. That has a big economic impact on the state. It creates another 2,500 jobs. I'm standing here in the main control room of the Relativistic Heavy Ion Collider, or what we call RIC. The Electron Ion Collider, or the EIC, is gonna add electron accelerator components to this facility to allow us to smash electrons and ions. What we're trying to do at the Electron Ion Collider is really trying to understand where this magnetization of the proton is coming from. A lot of facilities make isotopes, but at Brookhaven, the energy of our accelerators allows us to make isotopes which can't be made anywhere else. I want to talk to you about one of the most promising isotopes that we're working on, which is Actinium-225. So here you see a patient had responded to no other treatment, and here you have a complete response from Actinium-225. I am so glad that you were able to meet Jasmine because she is the perfect example of the Grow Your Own initiative here at BNL, which builds on the Department of Energy's workforce development programs. This beam line here, the SIX beam line, is the one where we're standing at right now. So we're standing right at the end of this, this pipe here. We optimize each one for a different type of experiment. So we have some that are looking at quantum materials like the one I'm here. We've got some that pharma uh, companies love to come and use looking at the structure of proteins. In fact, I should mention, we were very happy to have Pfizer here last year looking at their va vaccine. Yeah. Very proud of that. And it's a pleasure to welcome you to the new Brookhaven Data Center. Um, this is a state-of-the-art data center and quite uh, suitably, it's, it's one of our largest uh, recycling projects probably, because this is the old National Synchrotron Light Source building and we have repurposed the experimental hall to put a new state-of-the-art data center into it. Uh, we formed the Interdisciplinary Science Department about a year and a half ago, and the vision was to combine energy storage with energy systems. Here at Brookhaven, we've used our measurement expertise to develop advanced measurement and modeling solutions, especially for urban science. Brookhaven is leading 23 other institutions in the new DOE co-design center for quantum advantage. We call it C2QA. I'm very happy to report that here in BNL, we currently possess one of the most advanced quantum internet networks in the world. And this, the centerpiece for our campus strategy focuses on forging some new innovative public-private partnerships with Discovery Park being a catalyst for our campus of the future. I look forward to my next visit, Dune. Thank you so much for this opportunity as well, the leadership of the lab. Let's continue to go forward and change the world.